Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here back with another Borderlands 3 video. In this one, I'm going to be showing you guys how to complete this special mission. Now, this mission does require you to pick up these delivery burgers, and then you will then need to deliver them to five or six different locations around the map. Now, the challenge here on the right side does say to deliver the burgers within nine minutes. Now, you'll notice that the timer actually starts at nine minutes and that you need to go to all of these different locations, basically without the time going down at all. So there's some things that you guys need to do while along the route in order to actually make your time go back up. So if you destroy the competition signs, every time that you destroy a sign, it's going to give you about 20 or 30 seconds back. And that's how you're able to do this challenge and still have nine minutes remaining on the clock. So in this video, I'll show you guys the best possible route and I'll show you guys the exact signs that you guys need to break to finish this with nine minutes remaining. So after you finish the mission or as soon as you want to start it, the burger will pop up here on this counter. Now, as soon as you pick up the burger, it is going to start the timer. So you guys need to be ready pretty much before you guys actually pick it up. So right when you pick up the burger, you're going to see that this sign starts to glow red. These are the competition signs that you guys actually need to look out for. And these signs will actually give you time back every single time that you break one of them. So you want to have an AR or something like that on you so that you can actually reach these signs. You're going to be breaking them with your car and you're also going to be breaking them on foot just to save time. So make sure that you have a vehicle already pre-spawned in before starting the mission. You don't want to waste like 5 or 10 seconds walking over to the catch -a ride machine. Make sure the vehicle is parked right there and then you want to immediately start the mission. So you can get right in your vehicle, break the first sign that's right here. And you'll notice that the first burger stop is actually right around the corner too. So if you follow my exact route, you will get this done with no problem at all. You just need to make sure that you break the signs and that you actually drive all the way up to the door. If you drive like just outside of these locations, it's not going to give you enough time to actually run up to the door and deliver the burger. So right here at the first stop, before you drop the burger off, you can actually shoot that sign. Now, as you're jumping off the mountain, you're going to see that there's actually a red sign all the way down there that I'm already beginning to shoot at as I'm falling down. So before I even hit the ground, you can easily get that sign out of the way. You don't have to shoot it from as far away as I did, but just make sure that you break it at some point before leaving this area. So you're going to drive all the way up to the entrance of this place. You can jump right on out. You don't drive any further than this, but you want to walk all the way up this place. Now there's one sign that you're going to see on the top of this mountain. You want to make sure to break that while you're running past. Now there's still a little bit of leeway guys. Even after I finished this, I still had like 10 or 15 seconds remaining on the clock. So you don't have to be extremely perfect, but you just don't want to waste too much time. So you're going to notice that you can drop the burger off right here at this table. I actually kind of stumbled a little bit because it, you have to make sure that you're looking right at it. But you can immediately jump off and just slide as you land. And that's going to take a lot of time off trying to run back down. So just hop right back in your vehicle and follow my route. We'll be able to deliver the next two burgers with no problem. So after you drive back down here, if you didn't hit that sign yet, be sure to hit it. You're going to need to make a right now there's actually like three different signs that you need to hit. There's this one right here in the middle section. There's one all the way up here. Then there's the one on the right. So there's those three signs that you need to hit. You'll notice that there was a fourth sign on the highway, but I've decided just to skip it because you do not need it. So drive right up to the door. And then before you get back in your car, just break that final sign that is right there in between those caves. Now this mission took me a few tries to get it under nine minutes. So if at this point you see that your timer is not above nine minutes, you're probably best off just restarting just back out of your game because it's not going to matter how many signs you break at this point. You're not going to be able to finish. So drop that burger off. There's no more signs you need to worry about in between the one we just broke at the cave and the burger we dropped off. But jump back in your vehicle and you'll notice that as you swing around the corner, there's one sign here on the highway. And then there's also one more hanging here from the roof. So we're going to make our way around the corner and you just want to jump out of your car right at this little gate here. And there's actually one last sign we can break before dropping off the last burger if in case maybe it's really close for you guys. You'll see here that I still had plenty of time remaining on the clock before delivering that last burger. And then all you have to do is just drive back over to where you started and you will complete the mission. So even after completing the mission with nine minutes remaining, it did tell me that I could still continue doing it again and again. I went and ran it a second time and ended up doing it with nine minutes remaining on the clock again, but it did not give me any special reward or anything like that or make the mission disappear. So I'm not really sure what's up with that or if it ever goes away if you do something special, but I figured I'd let you guys know in order to actually get it done within the nine minute timer. So hopefully it helps you guys out and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.